How's it going, everybody? How's it going? perfect is um mum is running a little bit late so we're just gonna give her give her a second but straight to the point um today a viewer of ours named Esmeray gifted me something gave me the coordinator skin it's the S skin the A skin the S skin A A accessory I can't help, like, I can, there's nothing more I can do except thank Esmeray for that because I think before on past streams I talked about how pointless it is to, like, what is it, to gift, and I've never gotten a gift before, that's why I was saying that stuff, so I want to thank Esmeray for being so generous, here it is, I already opened it, I should probably put the sound down. Um, yeah, but thank you, Esmeray, for being so generous. And we're gonna try to get first cord because it's been so long. Mm, I'm sure you guys have all seen it. And she's got the little accessory in the back. I don't know which one's better. They're both good. But yeah, we're gonna play coordinator today. And it's gonna be fun because it's been a long time. Um, Coordinator is my most played character. Let me check the stream audio first so I know I'm not just talking to myself. Um. Oh, there she is. to listen to myself so I know I can hear or or you guys be able to hear Set the stream for a second. All right, hopefully it sounds better now. Cause it's the game sounded way too loud. Oh, you know what? I don't think I could change it. Never mind. I think it's fine anyway. So yeah. Spelled it right, right? <laughs> I love to do this. Oh, oh yeah, it works. Yeah. I'm gonna try out um, playing with the regular accessory that it comes with. And then I'm gonna switch over to lightning generator, see how that goes. It just combos better though. With the ace A accessory. 
And now it's the waiting game. <laughs> so we're just gonna sit here and wait for a match. Um, how high is Mama? Mama is. She's pretty high up there. We might be waiting a while. Congrats on the skin. <laughs> I didn't earn the skin. We just had a very generous viewer um, gift me it. Yeah, my first ever gift. Never got gifted before. And this is not to make you guys like think that you need to gift me because you know gifts are nice but they're way too expensive. So if you give me that's really nice of you, that's really generous. It means a lot to me that I mean so much to you, if you get what I'm saying. But otherwise it's fine. You can just tell me the words like you appreciate me. Because it's not it's not like you I'm not gonna see your chat. The chat is way too slow for that. Hey Macon. But still, anyway, I do appreciate the skin, Asmere. It's very nice. Um, it's not visible. The effects are invisible right now, but it's going to be more obvious in the game when we actually get one. Yeah, thank you, Asmere. <laughs> Big thanks, Asmere. I know Blue and John always have some sort of like sponsor out there, someone gifting them. I think it's always the same person that gives them the gift. And it's cool, and I'm like, man, I can't believe someone would spend that much money for them every single time. Imagine if someone did that for me. That would be a lot of money they had to spend. Like, I don't know, I would never gift personally. Mostly it's because I don't have any, like, income or anything. I don't work or anything. I mean, why would I? I have everything I want. Yeah, Moomoo's here. Makon, I think you asked one time if um, Moomoo and I could play together, and here we are. <laughs> it's only because Hokage isn't gonna be here. She said she's not gonna be here, so she told me to ask Moomoo. So that way I'd have, I'd have something to stream and <laughs> could show off the skin to all you guys. Show off isn't the right word, but... You know, just to show the skin, let's just say show. Let's be modest here. Um, originally, Esmeri was supposed to... She said she wanted to give me the mercenary skin, but... <laughs> I already spent my crystals on and my shards on the mercenary skin and the accessory. Which is, <laughs> and she had even said I play a really good mercenary. So you know, I think it would make more sense to give me coordinate to give me mercenary. But I also used to play coordinator a lot, and she's my most played character. So I'm okay with that. I'll play her. It's been a long time anyway, and she is she's getting some recognition in the meta again. She's seeing some use because of penguin, and there's less dream witches in the meta, which is good. You see more st more um, clowns, or at least there's one person who plays clown, and Coordinator is good for that kind of stuff, so. Yeah, now that I said that, we're only going to be facing Dream Witches, Rippers, and... Yeah. <laughs> and Blood Queens. Well, if we don't ban Blood Queens, which we will. No, oh, Photographer is a good one to play Coordinator against. Yeah, but today, since Coordinator is technically a rescue character, I'm not going to play Mercenary. <laughs> let me in, let me in. Let me in the book. Triple Rescuer? No problem. Okay. I hope... <laughs> I hope I don't miss any flares today. It's been a long time. 
Pew. Actually, it hasn't been that long. The last time I played Coordinator was a few days ago. Because someone keeps banning Mercenary. You really wanted to play with her? <laughs> oh, I guess I remembered wrong. Oh, right, you said you wanted to play with both of us. I just never play after rain. I just never want to spend my time after rain because my time is already so limited, putting two hours a day. Someone write what I said? Is my volume too loud? Is that what's going on? Someone please tell me if my volume is too loud. Easter. Easter's are a little scariest coordinators. Yeah. They're scariest coordinators. Ooh, why do I have to I turn on my coordinator? We have triple rescuers. Yes, yes, thank god. Okay, that, that changes the game. That changes everything. Oh, well. Sorry, Moo Moo. When she's right here. I should have pinged or something or said something. I like that the hunter is near me. Alright, so Mechanic is getting chased. You know, hypothetically, all four of us could be running Titan right now. Mercenary is and I am. Question is, who's gonna go rescue after the second time? You know, this brings up a lot of problems, playing coordinator. Like, who's gonna rescue now? No, oh, I didn't even. I didn't even talk about like the effects of the skin. You could see it right now. It's like a little red, red glow, I guess. I don't even know what it is. It's like a laser. A laser that disappears. So we have a problem. Mumu is in basement and I kill her robot. And yeah. <laughs> I messed up. I didn't mess up, but I didn't warn Mumu of her robot. Yeah, so... Mercury is gonna die now. And he's taking a bunch of tentacles, so I think Mumu's gonna get, take a regular hit. Because he's, he's, he doesn't have any recovery, so... Yeah. You see the safety gun. Okay. He's coming. Don't worry, Mumu, I'm coming. You're a robot. Honestly, I'm pretty sure it would have taken more time destroying those tentacles than decoding the cipher. It would have been close, though. It's only a 10% difference. Okay, maybe we can do something. It's possible. It's possible I could rescue Mumu. Where is she?
Sorry, thank God, he didn't find me mechanic. Oh wait, he's going into basement. Thank God I took Titan. I turn it wasn't needed. Please tell me Mumu is safe. She's not safe. We can't let her die. Hang in there, Mumu, please. Right. If he teleports, I have a gun. Dude! Better the code that. Volume sounds fine. Okay. If you guys if you say so, just let me know. Yeah, pretty skin. Thanks to Esmeralda. I didn't. I didn't buy it with Sparks. I bought the mercenary skin with my own um, fragments. Sorry, I, I say Sparks. I meant fragments. So we lost the moon. If he found a um, mechanic, then I'm not sure I would have been able to save her because I just wasn't close to her. I wasn't in a good position to surprise. Because if you're going to shoot at balloons, you need, to, you need to prepare yourself ahead of time. You got to hide. It's, like, it's an emergency thing that you should never do. Unless someone's about to die from chair, and you guys nearly have the cypher spine. That was the situation we were in. I know if I protect Mumu, she'll be able to kite long enough for that cypher to be popped. And with a few body blocks, it'd be no problem. So... That game mercenary should have stayed away. It was really concerning that he was starting to walk towards Momo, but thankfully he didn't. You didn't get notification, Bear? Eh, it's okay. I heard that YouTube streams don't give notifications. And it doesn't really matter to me. I mean, it's nice to know I have an audience, at least. Hey, Squishy Pagey. <laughs> I didn't say hi to you. Oh man, every 
time I look at the um, the people we match with, I see Mumu. I'm like, yes, we match with Mumu. And I'm like, then I realize I'm teaming with her. So coordinator again. No matter the map. Devs have neglected this server for a year now. I mean, ever since, ever since after that global tournament from last year, we just we just didn't get anything from that. We got a so-called summer tournament that was in September. Yeah, okay, devs. Summer tournament that was in September. Right, as school was starting. For me, it just started. For everyone else, it was already a month ago since it started. Hospital. Hospital, hospital. I'm gonna decode here and if Mechanic comes, I'm gonna have to give it up. And I hope she does because we kinda want our mechanic decoding on the second floor. Yeah, we definitely need our mechanic decoding on the second floor now. Why am I the one decoding? I should be the one decoding. for shaking it. It's about to start shaking. It's chasing mechanic. Okay. Give me up. Give me the heck up. Dungeon is here. I thought he left. I didn't actually think he'd come back. I would draw five ciphers because you can't be killed. Dude, overseer. Get out of here. 
seriously, that is the most plain mistake. Are you kidding me? I'm so dumb. And now our mercenary is hit for no good reason. ironic because he was the one that said oh never mind not even this <laughs> it's not a basement party if it's a court if there's a court in the basement Charge that fast. Well, I thought I would be able to get away. He must have like stun recovery or something. Because that is not how fast a hunter should recover. Doing? Why did I even shoot? I didn't even realize there was a portal there. Hmm. That is so annoying. I thought he would leave me. Mm. Honestly, I hate when people, when there are other people who are there when I'm trying to kite. Because then it confuses me where they are, where the hunter is. Like, who's being chased? Am I still being chased? Where is the, where like, where even is the hunter going? And some hunter, I don't know. How did she juke him? Oh. Oh, yep, that's it. Please tell me Overseer told um, Lawyer that his cipher is almost done. Seriously? This is how to not play Identity 5. Where's the teamwork? Don't save right now, oh my gosh. This is... There are so many things wrong, done wrong there. I'm not even gonna watch the rest of this. What should have happened is because I'm spectating, I can't. I can't actually see the messages. Overseer should have told lawyer, our priestess. His name is. I call him lawyer, but um, he should have told priestess where his cipher was so that he could finish it.
Yeah, that, that's, that's, that's communication with the guy in a nutshell. We should have at least tied that match. That's just dumb. So, what went wrong that game? Well, first off, I messed up because I didn't know where the hunter was in hospital, so then he got a free hit off me. And I wasn't sure if jumping down the hole cancels his... Cancels his soul, soul siphon or whatever it's called. I mean, I should have because it was my only option. Or maybe I should have shot him. I don't know, I didn't want to risk it. I didn't know if he was about to end his soul siphon or anything. It would be too risky to shoot. And on top of that, what else? Mercenary once started saving when Mechanic was going to save anyway. Even though Mechanic has no robots and can't decode, our Mercenary came in to cut hit anyway. Right? And it was for nothing. Because I'm in basement. And then finally, at the end of the game, no one pinged each other where their ciphers were at, so... Yeah, so... Overseer didn't ping the lawyer where his cipher was, even though he had it like 70%. And then Overseer went ahead and saved after half, even though he should have waited. If he waited, I think Priestess could have managed to prime her own cipher. So many things went wrong. Why didn't Priestess decode Mercenary Cipher? Because no one pinged each other. No one said like, oh, come to the Cipher. And if you don't do that, you're going to lose games. Because now you're decoding essentially six Cyphers. It doesn't cancel. And I should have jumped down there. Like, what other choice did I have? Gosh, I, th I keep thinking this little umbrella that's floating next to us is, is like Wu Ching Visit. It's, it's the puppet guy right here. Okay, technically he doesn't unless he puts on the persona build. Little kid lover. Congratulations for having the new skin. Thank you. Ha ba boom Is that like a Vietnamese name? Thank you, but I didn't really earn it. Someone just gifted it. Esmeray. But, um, yeah, if Mama could hear you, she would say hello as well. <laughs> or not hear you. See. See, I guess. You know, I'm gonna miss this calibration to see who it is. Spider. Okay, that's good then. This coordinator is good against Spider. Good rescuer, I should say. 
Burner isn't that great of a kiter, honestly. It's one flare bullet, and it really, I don't know. It takes you far, yes, but, I don't know. It's, it's sort of circumstantial, depending on whether you're in a good area or not. If you're right next to factory, then it's really good effective to use the gun. If you're in a bad area, and all around you is a bad area, it's just better to take the hit. Yes! Dodge the blink. Oh my god. I'm not gonna last long though. Yeah. There's just too many walls, I can't use the gun. You see, something like Enchantress would have been a lot better, Prospector. Turner's gun on for kiting is just so circumstantial. First off, the coordinator needs to be really good. My Wi-Fi just randomly went to 400 ping. Don't, I don't know why. Um, I took a hit because, yeah, the game randomly notifies me that my stream went off. So of course I'm gonna sit sit in place. Unfortunately, it's okay. Um, we're we're cipher primed, and I have a gun. Don't focus on decode. No, thank God, because if. <laughs> focused on the code you would have been kind of screwed. <laughs> um, please tell me the stream is going. No, the stream is not going. I don't know if my stream is going or not. It. Wait, what the heck? What happened? Seriously? I wasn't even paying attention. That wasn't even my fault, the stream just randomly crashed. Because my ping went to 400 for no good reason. Dude, who are these people? He died in the ga gate taunting. Well, guess what, guys? AO isn't the only toxic people out there. A well, people of AO aren't the only toxic ones out here. Die taunting in gate. Saying thank you to his teammates. This is just like... What kind of person can you be like? How, how can you be like that? That's just... This is a team game, and it's just, it's the opposite of team game, literally. It was gonna be a win, and he died in game. I'm streaming, right? What happened? Yeah. I'm streaming. Okay.
Is Sprinter not playing anymore? Apparently, yes. I didn't know that either. Something you say in private, but okay. <laughs> I, I'm forcing everyone else to play Mercenary today. How you guys like that? Huh? Huh? The problem is when I force other people to play mercenaries, mercenary, they're just, they don't have common sense. They save immediately after half instead of waiting. If the hunter isn't already um, on their tail. I don't know, they're, they don't look back while saving to make sure they're not about to get terrorized off. Like, I understand mistakes still happen, but like... For the most part, you should be consistent with not getting terror shocked as a mercenary. So when it does happen, it feels... <laughs> it feels awful, yes, but... It feels even better knowing that the last time you got terror shocked would be like, let's say, a month or two ago. So it's a Luchin, scary, because I'm not Perfumer. Perfumer has it easy against Luchin, or at least we have Perfumer saying get out of here in case he top breaks. That's like a warning sign that he's about to, oh. never mind. It's like a warning sign that the Luchin is teleporting to, to a shaking cypher, I'm not sure specifically. So, if you're cutting a Wuching and you guys see that he's about to teleport, say get out of here. And hopefully your teammates will understand now that Wuching is about to teleport on them. I doubt it because not even top players probably know about that. But, you better, better like start now than never, you know? At least 20 of you guys now have this tip and brain in your head. It's all about communication, really. Yeah, you better get out of here. I will rescue second. I don't think perfumer is gonna go up. I have to go immediately because because he's in white mode. I have to set myself up. So he doesn't catch me in a bad spot. Thank goodness he didn't put the mark on me. Wanted order. Oh 
Yeah, actually, I'm gonna wait. Get the chair, please. Hey, firework explosion. That was, I think, the first time. I'm the only one here right now, so it won't be too detrimental if you teleport on me. It'll definitely suck. I think he's gonna teleport. Yes. I heard him teleport. Post is clear. It's, it's all about using your instincts against each other. That's what separates a top player from a top top player. Using logic. So sprinters taking a break is what I'm getting. Was that the only time I shot my gun? No, I've shot my gun more than once. It's just I never look at the flare shot. It's more of something for the hunter to look at. We're gonna get first coordinator badge, boys. Although people actually play coordinator now, so yeah, thirty-five percent win rate. He's not gonna get too high up. I hate how there's always this red dot. It annoys me so much. It's like, an, it's trying to tell me there's a notification, but I can't see it. I think, I'm pretty sure there are likes. I don't think it's actually anything important. All right, I think Hunter spawns here, so. Yeah, Hunter's new here. If you can waste a Hunter's time by hiding, then your team is in the money. Every second they're not finding you, that's a second that's being added to decode, and that's a second of you hiding by doing absolutely nothing. I'll use an owl. Thank you.
Hmm. Oh man, if he teleports me right there, I would have just gone up the roller coaster as soon as he hits me. I would try to, I would try to do a regular play first, of course. But if by the time he hits me, I'm just gonna run up those stairs, right up that roller coaster. There needs to be like some sort of emote that all top players can use that tell each other where the roller coaster is, so that they don't go over there and then there's no roller coaster. second now. Any second now? No. I will use up the roller coaster because it is the fastest way. Oh my god, you guys see how close that was to being soul siphoned? I didn't even see. I nearly got soul siphoned. I don't want to decode here. It's a little dangerous. Oh wait, control us. Most may give a command to find him. Oopsie. <laughs> Alright, hopefully Tracer does not prime this guy because we want Mercenary to prime his. Don't. Okay, well. Now it's a little less efficient because I had to walk over there. I was hoping most. Oh my god, here we go. Now I can't talk for the next, <laughs> next 60 seconds. the skin. the fact Cornier is running with high heels this entire time. <laughs> That's crazy. Dungeon, please. Aw, oh, no dungeon. No, he should have dropped that for that reason. If you don't drop the power, you just give him a chance to use the bell.
息。Beautiful owl. <laughs> he was a beautiful owl indeed, but only because I said help me. That moment your rank session isn't going that bad. Yeah, it could be. It could. The funny thing is, it could still be going a lot better. We're just we're getting people who are making some big mistakes. Like, I know I've been making mistakes, but they've been making mistakes where it could have been a tie and instead it was a loss. Or maybe it was a win and then it was a tie. Hi, Seki, hope you are well. I'm just forwarding a message from All For One. He wanted to, he wanted to apologize for some bad things he said about me in the past. Well, have a great rest of your evening, sir. Thank you, TT. I didn't even know he did. <laughs> I don't keep up today on Discord or his YouTube or literally anything that has to do with Identity Five, unless someone says it in the game directly. Um, I have no idea. I had no idea he was saying stuff. Glad I glad you got the skin, Yen. Yeah, it was thanks to Esmeré. Big thanks to Esmeré for the skin. Because I bought the mercenary skin with my sparks. With my crystals, with my shards. <laughs> I have the original skin because I, I still like the original better. But right, here's the actual skin. I do have it. I spent my shards on it. Before, Esmeri was gonna give me the mercenary skin one, but then she changed her mind. She saw me, she saw I already had the mercenary skin, so she got me this one, which is still super generous. And it's very thoughtful because I used to play coordinator a lot. She's actually my most played character. I've played twice as many games with her as any other character. Which we're talking about over a thousand, like maybe a thousand six hundred. <laughs> All for one finally apologized. Kind of came out of nowhere, not gonna lie. You didn't even know about it. Anyway, it's okay. If he apologized and he said bad things, well, I don't even want to know about it. Let's just get it behind us now. Psyche, give us some coordinator tips. Okay. So, things have changed a lot since season 1, 2, and 3. Before then... Back then, Coordinator used to be very meta because of Clown and Soul Weaver, kind of. But then that started changing with Ripper because Ripper just she can kill the Ripper can kill the Coordinator um, with two hits, and it was concerning. So then everyone started switching to Mercenary. But the long story short is, back then you couldn't, no one, you never, you never had the right to shoot your gun, like almost never, because you needed to save her for the save. Which I think was a flawed, flawed um, concept on our part back in those early seasons. My, my tips with Coordinator now is... Coordinator is like a second saver now. You should always have a Mercenary. If you're going to go Coordinator, you guys should still have a Mercenary on your team. And you're going to serve as the team's second rescuer. So that mechanic, whoever's mechanic, can run broken windows and she is more likely to survive. And since you have a gun, you can protect yourself with it from the hunter if you if, if you end up kiting. Um, my number one rule with the gun is to just don't even think about it. Don't even only just try to kite at first. Because if you think about using it, then you're gonna try to use it, and you're even and you're gonna be, you're very likely to hit a wall. It should be like a last resort. Your gun. If you're next to roller coaster, use the gun. I mean, if you can't take a hit, I would rather you take a hit. If you're next to hospital and you can't take a hit, use the gun. And the reason you use your gun is so you can get to those really good kiting places, kiting areas, so that you can, you know, guarantee you're going to kite for like the next 30 seconds. Because if you're going to use your gun on kiting, 
make sure it's either A, like, I don't know, to rescue yourself and you're about to die on a chair or something like that, then obviously, but B, to get yourself to a really good area. Otherwise, I would save it for, if you don't get a good chance to use it, that's perfectly okay. In fact, if I were you, I would almost save it until you've been on the chair. But that depends, of course. If you're in an open area, go ahead, use the gun. But what I'm trying to say here is don't use the gun if you're next to walls. It's way too risky. Just use the gun when you're in an open area or when the hunter stings still. Um, that, usually that happens when after you get chaired. Because the chairs are in open areas and the hunter's recovering. So that's a great time to use your flare gun. Using your flare gun at any other time... Whoa. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Using your flare gun any other time... You have to have some experience with, of course, you have to know when you're, the flare is gonna miss or hit. <laughs> hit or miss. And you're gonna miss your flare gun a lot when you're gonna be learning coordinator. That's okay. It's something you learn over time, like... Like, how does the flare gun work? How fast does it travel? How far can you shoot it from? And... Oh. Yeah, we really needed a mercenary that game, but I'm going to go cord. And this is going to bite us in the butt, because coordinator... Uh, Wildling and coordinator... Not, not that good. Like I said, coordinator, she's a mad kiter. Her gun isn't always useful in every area. She has a hard time dealing with hunters like Ripper that hit through walls. So that you, you can't hit him with the gun, but he can hit you with your blade. With his blade, I should say. Ooh. Who is this? This is Penguin. Yeah. Alright, good thing I went coordinator. Because ping because coordinator shuts down penguin on the rescue. Did that help? That was all over the place. I'm I'm sorry. Um I missed the calibration because I'm not sure if he's gonna come back for me. Or if he's really gonna chase wild again. Do I accept offer one's apology? Of course. I don't even know what he said. So I'm alright with it. How do you think about right left cord? If the mechanic agrees to have tie turner, then sure, you can have right left. But at least two people on your team need tie turner. If you're gonna go tie turner, the mechanic can go on um, broken windows. And I would almost rather the mechanic go broken windows. Actually, okay, that's arguable, but. It's your choice. Let's just save right now. I'm not really paying attention to the game. I should have saved a little bit later. If you could just outrun this penguin. Penguin's playing with fire chasing the wild wing. Um, oh, another tip. Okay, I went over the kiting portion of coordinator. What about saving? When when should you use your gun and when should you not use your gun against um the hunter on the rescue? So if you save Hold up. I might need to concentrate. Dang. <laughs> he got me there. I can't really do anything now. The bomb eventually explodes. I don't know when. Though. Who's calling me? 
I don't really have anywhere to a good spot to put it. In fact, I think it's in the exact same, like, I think that was Slater. Yeah. Okay. And that was like the, the best portal you could possibly get. You have one side of the portal on the ship and the other on the other side of the map. And now he's gonna destroy it. If dungeon is there, then there's no way I'm rescuing. I can't rescue. So when should you use your gun versus when? While saving the coordinator. If you do the rescue, and then the hunter hits you, then I would not suggest using the gun because the hunter will pop. You, the person will probably have enough distance to survive after that. But if you take a hit first before rescuing and there's still time. Okay, well, I can't waste any more time. That's cool. No, it's not primed, it's not primed. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's not primed. It's like 95%. Well, I shouldn't have said that. Gosh, everyone's writing stuff in chat. Okay, I gotta get to chat. Did I just reference a meme? Yes, somewhere in there I referenced a meme. I don't remember what it was anymore. It was something. What's your opinion on Anne? And do you think she'll be banned in Legendary? Honestly, I forgot what she even does. <laughs> is that supposed to come out this week? Alright, what I remember is because I played with someone. Oh, Esmeri actually. <laughs> I played with Esmeri. She already has. I think it was Esmeri. Please don't tell me I'm thinking of someone else, but I'm pretty sure Esmeri, the same person who donated the skin for this Coronier skin, she already had the Ant skin. 
I'm pretty sure oh, if Esmeri is watching this and look, someone all I remember is someone um used the N agreed with me to play matches with, against N. And I don't know. I'm trying to predict with the cats. I don't know if it's gonna be good. I don't think it's gonna be good. It's like a worse version of patrol. Like, why would you pick Anne, which is a cat, like, which has cats? Like, why would you pick a hunter that... Guys, I need to concentrate. <laughs> Alright, well, I know where I'm going. Well, seriously, this house, bro. If I get hit, I know where I'm going. God, why am I lagging? Why am I lagging? This game's gonna kill me, seriously. And I don't think she's that good because her ability is a little bit circumstantial. Please, Falk. Yes. Thank God. Guys like that? Snipe? Oh my god, mercy. No, mercy, get out of here. I didn't think I would come back. Oh my god. I don't think it's gonna be that good. This is what I'm trying to um, suggest. Because the cat only activates if if the hunter gets close. Dude. Dude, blink! Get out of here! Like, seriously, why? why? He doesn't have a pig, he doesn't have anything. Why is he walking towards the hunter? <laughs> Guys, don't use wildling. Literally, don't use it. That's my message to you guys. Don't use if you use wilding, it's a terrible idea. No one's here. <laughs> they have like zero decode. Minus 10%, minus 25%, minus 40%.
Who's that? Let's freeze this. Mercenary? What? I thought it was mercenary at the very least. Why is Wild here? Come on. There's nothing I could do. How did that even reach me? Like, is the question. <laughs> that was not supposed to reach. Um, is Cypher really fine? But... Wow, the switching got so lucky. So lucky that that somehow reached me. Another important tip for penguin is that, not penguin, coordinator. If you feel like you're not going to be able to save, it's okay. Like, don't wait for them to hit you. Just shoot. If it's like a ripper or a penguin and you're really scared that they're going to kill you, before you get to save, just shoot them. Same with perfumer. If you're scared you're gonna, but you're about to get hit, just use the perfume. Game? Yeah, there we go. That's how much overseer. That's how much I'm leaving the game. You can just so long. You're also leaving. Sprint was also leaving. Oh, he already left. <laughs> Quote: Taking a break. Is, was that all for one now? Was was the was the Wuching all for one? Is that what the Chinese name is? Pretty much hunters are broken. Well, when you got blood, okay. <laughs> the thing is, we're going against Wu Ching, so I don't even I can't even say hunters are broken. <laughs> Alright, now he's just some random Chinese name that I can't read. His name was something. How do I check my record from here? I don't think I can. You used to be able to check records in game. <laughs> that guy used to play Thief. Yeah, Blank used to play Thief. I'd rather he play Thief than Wildlands, please. If you're gonna take balloon hits, just play Thief. It takes your time away from your family and it's unhealthy. Okay, that's a viable reason. I mean, if I stop playing this game, I'm just gonna play like Minecraft or something, so... It's not much of a difference in terms of healthiness for me. Uh, 
No, I understand you guys. I understand what you mean. When Hokage isn't there, I, I love taking the day off. Just not playing rank match at all. Doing something else instead of rank match for once. And what else? When it's Wednesday, I always look forward to Wednesdays. I always appreciate the day off. It's the one day I get to play... One day I... One day we don't have to play the game. And although that's that's probably a bad thing... Oh, it's, hey, it's over here. Yeah. Um, it's probably a bad thing to be looking forward to the days I don't have to play the game. But I do legitimately also enjoy playing the game. And if we don't have someone pick Sierra, then I'm gonna go Sierra. I don't care. That's plenty of coordinator games. But... I'm taking the full 20 seconds. tournaments anymore you guys remember the um in the 2018 halloween tournament it was it was like three months after the game released and it got all the top players so hyped up that they started playing this game and there's already a tournament ready for them like imagine that imagine you start playing a game and there are tournaments to be the best Like, it will give you something to work forward, to work for, to look forward to. And what is there now? We just have a lousy rank match, and we match with two other random pairs who may, who may as well just be worker bees hidden as champions. And I'm not going to name any names, because of course that would be incredibly toxic of me. And I don't want to be the next doc or something like that. But, honestly, that's how it is. We don't get anything for our work. The only tournament that's really a big deal now is the global tournament. And we only get that because Chinese server also gets it. So it's not even because the devs are doing that, doing that out of generosity. It's just because, you know, they want their game to be international. Kindly, I respect your decision to go barmaid, but perfumer is always the better option. Oh, thank you, Mumu. Barmaid is a good, um, oh god. Barmaid is a good, um, alternative if perfumer's already picked. And, um, I'm guessing we're just gonna let her die. Because... There's no way any of us are saving from photograph or basement. And I should have probably hid, but in in case he activates the camera right as I start moving, then all he has to do is hit me one time, so I die to win. And I want him so that if he finds me, he has to do the full terror shot so I can still be healed. In the case that he doesn't put me on chair. If he does put me on chair, I could still be here, though.
if I dropped that, he would have finished. Almost like for sure. For sure, he would have finished. I didn't even use my own. I would have done it great as coordinator then. That's already done. Ooh, this is not gonna be good. I definitely don't want to be dying next to this. That's <laughs> still next to basement where I'm least I'm holding it. Oh, that's a yikes. Alright, so I didn't use my owl. Which, now that's a game changer. So, either one of us can go rescue, honestly. Ping? Ping is yellow. Leave, just leave over here. Go, go. Get yourself out of there. I'm not about to risk the bottom drop. It wasn't actually fun. Sorry over here. I didn't it wasn't it was just barely fine. It's two funbies. Two funbies. Okay. <laughs> that's that's new. Everyone's giving over share wishes. Farewell wishes. We have Doctor. Synergize as well with mercenary. It's A38. I did plenty of coordinator games. Okay. One mercenary game. Or maybe two. We'll see.
Riri, you only start playing until season eight. The game, the server had its own tournament at one point dedicated for them. And then there was this, like this year there was the summer tournament. And it wasn't even the summer, so it was talked about in July and it didn't happen until September. I mean, at least the Halloween tournament was actually during the Halloween week, the week of Halloween. Why is everyone saying focus on decoding? Is it photographer? There will be a camera right there. Even then, if it was a photographer, I would expect everyone to say get out of here. Speaking of which, it might be Wuchen. What is that noise? Which hunter that makes that noise? Definitely not Priestess. Oh, Priestess Portal. Oh, they got through. It's great. The game makes you stressed out and tired. There used to be a reason to play in the game. When you played rank match, it was towards the ultimate goal of competing in a tournament. And the Chinese have that. They have a tournament every season. They have a tournament every season, and it's nice. They get paid to play. It's actual. Comp it's actually competitive in the Chinese server. The game is blowing up there. They're making huge profits. And us, we're just a byproduct of that. We don't even get some of the stuff they get. And forget about tournaments. When you play this game, there's no reason to. Like, if you plan on getting high tier for the purpose of, like, I don't know, showing your skills off in, let's say it's just a regular old tournament, well, you can say goodbye to that unless you're um, going to go to the global tournament. Call the Abyss, which is happening this May. And the chances of getting into that is really low. The chances of me getting into global is really, really low because AO, if trying to compete with AO, it's ridiculous because they have all the good members already. There's not many people left who can compete. Detective Carrots, it seems we have an interesting Easter egg in our Upcoming map. Okay. Guys, watch this. Don't be a fool to this. Oh, wait. Oh, the spell ran out. Okay. I was about to say, don't be a fool. Two hundred IQ plays right there. <laughs> Don't run into tentacles. Um, if you have the spell on you, the nightmare effect on you, and someone's about to go down from, from, from a tie turner, please, please don't be that mercenary that just keeps walking forward, and then gets hit by the tentacle, because one appeared right on you, right as someone um got knocked down from the tie turner. Don't be that mercenary. Thank God I could rescue right after a tentacle hit. What the? Oh my God! This should not have activated that. I was I wasn't ready for it. I I got I let my thumb go. over here okay I think Mumu has 30% faster heal on teammates and I get healed 30% faster on myself oh please can the hunter not be there Thank the Lord. 
He was there, but it was on the opposite, on the other side. Thank God. Way too close. So yeah, me trying to get into Call of Abyss, I deserve it. I deserve getting into Call of Abyss, but AO has all the good people. And yes, there are other people out there, but most of them can't go to the Chinese server. So when you account for that, you may have like only four people that aren't in AO that can go. We're not talking just eligibility. If they got first place, like let's say AO didn't, AO didn't get first place this time, but it's, I heard it's, it's been really difficult trying to get enough members to go to China. Because no one can go except AO. They they have everyone. They should add new modes into the game. Blackjack was really cool. That was a cool mode, but it only lasts like a week. I don't know. Making a making game modes in a game that's so so self so, it's so centered around the just the idea of being chased buying time and catching people it's what it, there's very little you could do with that i don't know it's not like we're not talking minecraft skill here this is a new game concept that can go little ways it's not like mario kart where you can do a million things with it and Mario Kart, the, the game devs just aren't adding new game modes. There's so much they could do. Like, make items rain from the sky. Like, that could be one. Blackjack isn't fun when the hunter chases you and someone else already has blackjack. My problem with blackjack is I can kite... I would kite, like... 100 seconds of the match and obviously not even the, the best player in the world can kite for 120 seconds without getting hit once like we're talking foggy blade feast or tentacles like this is not just like basic attacks like if it were just basic attacks it would be easier but there's ripper blade there's spider web there is everything that doesn't kill you in one shot but accumulate you can't kite those for 120 seconds so when i kite for like 100 seconds the hunter has no choice but to pick me up because there's no no more time to try to find someone else at that point and it's annoying because i don't get rewarded for doing a really long kite in fact you get punished because then the hunter's like okay i waste all my time on you and i don't have any time to like catch someone else for points so they pick you up and it sucks and it's now balanced in that regard. Blackjack is fun when I'm the hunter. Yeah. Blackjack is fun when you're a spider and you're just zooming all over the place. Is it repetitive even if you team with friends? Well, when I first started playing the game, my, the ultimate goal was global finals. I saw AO. We all saw AO. At the Call of Abyss last year. And I got really jealous. I'm like, that could be me. But instead, here I am, not playing every rank match every single day. Instead, I'm slacking off. That could be me. I could be known. I could be a top player. And I could be up there. And that's what I work, work towards. I work towards, like, let's say other competitions. Like the Halloween tournament. But it never showed up. The only one was the summer tournament. And you know, at that point, I'm like, let's not even bother. Because it's not even summer anymore and I have school. It's, it would, I don't think it was at a convenient time for me either. I mean, I didn't even have a team. There would be all these sorts of stuff that I didn't do. Two hours, two hours of our time on this game is a lot. I'm not gonna, no, there's no denying that. Two hours every single day. It's not, it's not a lot. If you have your days off, if you have a day off and you're not doing anything, if you have no school, 
All right, looks like I'm going mechanic. Let's just, let's switch it up. We did a lot of coordinator games. Let's have some diversity. What was I talking about? Oh yeah, two hours of our time. It's not a big deal if it's in the summer. Or if we have school, I get home at like four. There's three hours until rank match starts. And then I gotta go to sleep like two hours later. Thankfully, I live um in the central time zone, so rank ends at nine. So it's... Man, it would suck if my rank session was at, after my bedtime. Or like, right, it ended right at my bedtime. That would suck, because that would be... I don't want to... I don't want the last thing I do in my day to be identity 5. Like, there's a reason I don't watch identity 5 when I'm about to go to sleep, because I already played two hours of that. I just want to get it over with. Alright. You guys want to see some big brain mech plays? Oh, my God. Okay, I have to get my hands away from the screen so so I can see when he's about to go on the camera. And he is definitely targeting me, so... I don't think this is going to be a viable camera position. Is he actually gonna miss the robot? Oh my god. Mm, I can't do anything. That's so annoying. He just breaks power so fast. There is nothing I can do. He just breaks power way too fast. That's why I don't like going mechanic. Okay, I didn't even show my big brain neck play. Because he was attacking me with the camera. No, he's not gonna be able to save me. God, Elias, you're too far away. Oh! No way. I don't have anywhere to go. <laughs> That's a stun. Don't get trapped. Please, whatever I do, don't trap myself. Stay in an open area. This is what I tell myself. Please. He's got a boom. He has a blink. He has a blink. Oh my god, what the... You piece of garbage, what the power.
Just give me that. No, my robot! I didn't mean to. Wow, that is so dumb. I thought I was right next to the power. I was gonna vault it. No. We can't lose. We can't lose now. I did so well. Don't save me, no! Get away too early, that is not how you do it. Thank you, Roba. Jeez, <laughs> it took a while. Yes, focus on the corner, it's alright. Alright, that was very smart on Mumu's part. She didn't activate it because she because Overthrown is not the one kiting. Very smart of you, Mumu. Thank you. Nope. Very predictable. The biggest part with Mad Eyes is not letting your hand cover up where the camera is. Because then you have no idea there's a camera. Dude, come on. It's just our teammate. Oh, it's Overthrown. Hey, Overthrown. No need to worry. Okay, you may need to worry because it's going to teleport. Oh, you know what? He doesn't have any energy. Yeah, he doesn't have energy. That was very clutch. <laughs> Central gang rise up. <laughs> Seven to nine. better. No, central better. No, EST. I didn't even get to show my, um, okay. <laughs> Mad eyes it is. I didn't get to show off. I do want to win this one, so I'm gonna go mercenary. Mercenary, mechanic, mercenary. The rest were coordinator. We're gonna check our coordinator rank after this hour. More like mine, but it's a team effort here. <laughs> sort of.
you know, I haven't acknowledged this fact, but it's really weird. It's really strange to me having both the S skins that are out in the shop right now. Because usually I have neither, and this is one of the few times I have one of them. And Esmer even gifted me another one day. I've never actually bought any of the S skins from the shop. Because it's I just either didn't like it, or I didn't have the um I didn't have the um, what's the crystals for it, the shards. The Ripper skin, that one is awesome. That one is awesome. But I didn't have enough for it. So I just saved and saved and I ended up getting 21,000 and I bought this mercenary skin. It takes it takes several seasons to get 21,000, let me tell you that. Oh, and if you've been playing the game for a while, then almost all your rank spheres give you... Almost all your rank spheres will give you... Sparks. Sparks fragments. If you've been playing the game a while, then you already have everything and you get a lot of... In fact, you get more fragments from the rank, S rank spheres in total than like being a champion at the end of a season. Because I always save my rank spheres until the end of the season. You guys probably saw. There's like 40 of them waiting right now. I should have 50. Admittedly, but because Hokage hasn't been playing a lot. She has, she's had finals. And I respect that. And uh, to be honest, I kind of like my days off. Who is this? This is probably all for one. Seriously, this is so stupid. I even elbow padded away. And may this be a reminder to all why we banned Blood Queen. I understand it was an accident, though. Oh yeah, that cowboy last game was God. <laughs> he he just barely saved me. And that, and that actually turned out to be a really good kite afterwards. So Elias saved the match. <laughs> right as I said that, he died. But don't worry about that. Everyone's giving me a good job. Thanks, guys. I should have kited longer, but I wasn't I wasn't next to the pallet. I was running into the wall and then he got me. I messed up. I don't know, I just had this feeling he was gonna blink me. It, it's been 150 seconds. Time really flies against Mad Eyes, because he spends a lot of time on his machine. So everything he does is slower. Speaking of slow, we're at four ciphers. Bro is with y'all? Oh, my bad. Uh, um, yeah. Overthrown is with us. He was here last game as well. He was pretty clutch. With the, um, cipher activation. No, that wasn't him, actually. That was someone else. Alright, game over. It's a game over. Oh, this is in the basement. Alright, guys. Chess time, because we're going to lose the game. All right. Maybe we'll get a syringe, and we're going to be heroes, and we're going to save the game. And Elias is going to kite for three ciphers against the fully fed. Alright, there's step one. There's step one then. Oh, are those the elbow pads? Dude, never mind. The elbow pads are awesome. I thought it was really weird that Mercenary has cat claws. <laughs> okay. We got the syringe part. Minus the saving part. Oh, we could still do it. No, we can do it. If we do perfect elbow pads.
All right. GG. God, my tail is going to expose me. Just going to sit here sneaky like a cat. No, he didn't see me. Bye. It was all for one, it wasn't it? Yeah. Him and Lan Lan, Lan have the skin for Blood Queen. Why don't I duo with Overthrow and Overseer? Don't- they already have a duo, don't they? Yeah, Overthrow And I think I have Overseer. Yeah. Oh, Overseer's alone. Oh well, yeah, because he wasn't playing with anyone. All right. I think that's it. Good night. Good night. Exchange kisses. Psych. Don't say Moom. Don't tell Moom I said that part. Yeah. <laughs> you can tell I've been slacking this season because I don't have the skin yet. I'm 500 away, so something tells me I'm not going to get it. Yeah, it's okay. It was, it's just a wildling skin. It's not like it really matters. Disappointed. Lone Wolf is here in the chat. Or someone's someone's talking about Lone Wolf. Yeah. <clears throat> Chest time. Yes, the only time I'll ever say chest time. I'm just trying to reach out, trying to catch up. People will ban the new hunter? I don't think so. I'm gonna look at her abilities one more time. She's pretty creepy. Probably this game's second creepiest hunter after Soul Weaver was added. 
and the cat's name is Cat. You can tell because there's, it's not called the cat. It's just called Cat. Cat was born into a dark shadow and ignores walls. And you could split the cat into two and it goes perpendicular of where it was going. And you can kind of, as a survivor, you can bait it out. Bait tactics. Make it look like you're going to go one direction and juke, juke the cat out. And it's really difficult. There's there's a lot of assumption going on and that's why it's circumstantial because you're hoping the survivor is going to juke and I don't know. It just, unless the hunter is right next to you, that cat is going to have a hard time reaching you. Catwalk though. Um, the person who played um this hunter against me, they weren't using this ability. So I don't know if there's potential with her. Catwalk, I don't know how fast she goes. I don't know if she can ignore through she can ignore pallets to get straight to you. I don't know. This might be good. We'll have to see. He never got a chance for that three cipher kite against fully fled, fled queen. <laughs> Rip Elias. I do main mer mercenary, by the way. Usually it's Mumu who gets to hatch. Yeah, but when the hunter. Puts a mirror right on top of her. It's pretty difficult to survive anywhere after that. Bye, Psyche Cutie. Okay. Okay, that's for Blue Race Car, not for me. <laughs> he can be a part of that cutie nonsense. Bye, Psyche. Thank you for the stream. No problem. Open up your spheres. Open them, please. Essence opening. This is for the end of the season. Is there anything good? Mm. Okay. Okay. I mean, for a dream, which you mean, of course. And this one's like, uh, who even uses Dancer? Oh, underwhelming for this season. I don't know, they're just... With Clown? I don't know, we'll have to see the effect for Clown. But right now, you could buy this accessory. Hold on, let me... Oh, oops. There's this one. There's this one from Season 2. There's this one where you could buy any time. And it's pretty cheap, too. I mean, <laughs> if you're a high-tier player, it is cheap. 3,888 is cheap. For me. <laughs> Watch gameplay of N. Okay, that's the thing. I haven't watched any gameplay of The Hunter. I just keep... I just... Whenever there's spoilers for something, I never watch it. That smile could melt my heart. What smile? Is there some face Kim I don't know about? Oh, the clown accessory is a new carry. Oh, you're right. All right, it is then. Okay, it's decent then. If you like carrying motions. My bad then. That, okay. Okay, that's fine. Oh, I was supposed to show you. Okay, not that part, but apparently my favorite survivor is Coordinator, which I played a total of 1,470 matches. To give you guys an idea, the last time I seriously played Coordinator was three seasons ago, and nothing comes close to beating it out. Let's see here. Oh, you guys remember this page of the notebook? Who even remember? Who even reads this stuff? Jeez, how do I look at my character progress? 
Is it Persona? Oh, right here. 340, 438 matches with coordinator. And this takes all your wins into the consideration ever since you started playing the game. Wait a minute. No. No, it doesn't. I played Thief several times back in the day. Wait, but I haven't used Magician once this season. This is confusing. I haven't used Prospector once this season. I haven't used Doctor once. Well, maybe I have one time, but I don't remember. Oh, I used to main Mind's Eye. Yeah, so the most I have with is Coordinator. The second most is Perfumer, third most is Mercenary. Yeah, nothing beats out Coordinator. What's my ranking with Coordinator? Okay, 112. It's better than like the 200 something it was at earlier. Alright, so I guess I'm calling the stream calling the stream here. That'll be it. You need to watch me more? I've been doing YouTube wrong. I this whole time I've been thinking I just realized this today. Like why am I trying to make guide videos? Like very like anything that requires a lot of editing, a lot of clips put together, I just don't put my mind into it. And I realize why don't I just do like some commentated gameplay? It's one of Blue Race Car's most popular videos, just commentated photograph or gameplay. Or heck, not even commented it, just put music in the background. When he says he'll end the stream like 20 times, I know. I never do. Alright, but now I will for real. Alright. Inspire, hey Psyche, miss you. It's been a while. Inspire, do you still play? I haven't seen you around. Wow again. You still do? I just haven't seen you then. I'm not even that high either. Four stars. I should be way higher. It's just Hokage hasn't been playing a lot. What is this? Deduction male performer. Able partner? What does this stuff even mean? What does it mean to be an able partner? A, a male performer because because that's something we need in our society a male performer all right bye guys for real now see ya <laughs> good night